<clears throat> all about aubergines. This week, um, I'm going to be talking about aubergines. They are great for absorbing flavors. You know, from our iconic um, side display, from the roasted aubergines to the burnt aubergines that are used for dips or to make sauces. So there's lots of varieties of aubergines. So this one is what you will commonly find in most supermarkets, most UK supermarkets. You also, oh, my aubergines <laughs> fell. So I'm just going to call them long aubergines. These are just a smaller version of these ones. I also have a different kind of light pepper one. This one. <laughs> it was a flying aubergine, they're alive. They're alive with flavor. <laughs> Aubergines, aubergines, that's what everyone wants to eat. Aubergines, aubergines, they're not a vegetable, they're berries. <laughs> Today, I'm going to make baby aubergines in tomato sauce with an anchovy and dill yogurt. So I'm going to start with these onions. So now I'm going to add all this butter to the pan. And to this pan, I'm going to add our onions and the whole garlic cloves. Together. I'm also going to add some salt. And this will cook for 25 minutes until it's very soft and very caramelized. Make sure that you stir frequently, you don't want it to get stuck at the bottom. We're cooking this on medium-high heat, so it's really, really important that you keep an eye on it. So now that your onions and garlic are very nicely caramelized, you can see all that um, all these onions have become this tiny small caramelly pile. Now I'm going to add the tomato paste and this will cook for five more minutes. While the um, tomato paste is cooking I'm going to blitz these tomatoes. So there's 800 grams of tomatoes in here. I've just cut them in quarters so they all go in here. And then a quick blitz. Now that our tomato tomato paste has cooked out, it's all very nice and glossy. The oil has turned red. So now I'm going to add our blitz tomatoes very carefully. Give it a good mix. And this cooks for 10 minutes or until the tomatoes come together um, into a very nice and glossy sauce. Sauce, that's it, sauce. So the tomato sauce is ready and the aubergine are part cooked. I'm going to add the aubergines in here. Be careful because they're very, very hot. Don't do like me, use tongs if you need to. I'm going to add some cherry tomatoes, 200 grams of cherry tomatoes to the sauce. Just need to nestle these in here. Make sure that your aubergines get the sauce, cover them a little bit. So now this pan is going to go in the oven at the same temperature, this was at 2.30, uh, for 10 minutes. We just want the top of the tomato to get a bit of colour and these uh, cherry tomatoes are going to blister and burst in the oven. While that's in the oven for 10 minutes, I'm going to make the anchovy and dill yoghurt. So here's the yoghurt, 
and in go the anchovies. This is about 30 grams of anchovy fillets and some dill I picked earlier. This is 20 grams of picked dill and bitsy bitsy. This also needs some lemon juice. I'm going to ha add half a tablespoon of lemon juice. Give it one more turn. Okay. Now the aubergines are ready. Um, I'm going to take this pan out. So you can see that the cherry tomatoes we added in the end, they've blistered and the aubergine have had some time to suck up all that tomato sauce and you've got some colouring in the tomatoes on top. So while the aubergines are resting, I'm going to make the burnt butter. So I've put the butter in, um, in this pan on uh, medium heat. I'm going to let it melt gently and let the milk solids at the bottom start turning brown and you will know when it's ready because it's going to smell nutty so this will take about five to six minutes so now I'm going to take this off the heat it's still foaming and here I have some toasted cumin seeds I'm just going to give them a quick bash in here and in the go. So after the cumin seeds, in go the chili flakes, and I think we need some salt. Just a little bit. So our aubergines have has rested. Um, the cumin and chili burnt butter is ready and let's assemble well assemble let's play it up i'm going to put some of this lovely anchovy yogurt let's put some of it in here i won't put all of it and just save the rest to serve on the side i think you need some dill Now, I'm going to spoon some of this chili and cumin bun butter on top. I know it's a little bit, um, quite a bit of butter, but I do love butter. I'll save the rest of this for people who love butter like me. I love the baby aubergines. We don't use them enough. No, we I don't. Think they're so like cute. Little sponges. They are little sponges. But they're like super velvety and meaty and delicious here. Mm. If I wanted it vegan, mm. I could just do it all with olive oil and then just do like a non-dairy A non -dairy. yogurt or something. Yeah, yeah. Use yeah. the anchovies, use mm. some capers. That would be nice. Mm. 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 Yum! This is so good. Thank you, Chaya. Mm. That sounds like a headache. Oh my god. <laughs>